And this is a book that my daughter has written. I'm Monique's mother. It is called Incarcerated But Free. And inside the book, she tells about the struggle and the pain that she had to go through. And while she was going through that struggle, she was living with me. And I'm going to tell you right now, I went through the same struggle, the same pain, the same heartache. And that's what happened to the parents outside. If you have someone on the inside, you struggle. You go through. You hurt. But you don't really know what to do. Uh, I don't mean to say all that, but I am supposed to do the closing prayer. We just bless the Lord this afternoon. Father God, we come to you in the precious name of Jesus, knowing that all things are possible through you who strengthen us. Father God, we just thank Melvin, and we just thank you for giving him the wisdom to come up with freedom for Alabama. And Father God, we know that he had the faith. And we know faith is that substance hope for evidence of things not seen. And right now, Father God, we know that you can do exceedingly, abundantly above anything that we could ever ask or think. Father God, right now, we pray for release of mentally, physical, incarcerated for all the prisoners. And Father God, we are asking for total freedom. And right now, Father God, when we ask for total freedom, we know that when we are free, we are free indeed. In the precious name of Jesus, we pray. Amen.